In this video, we are showing you how to perform our top three most useful techniques for wound closure. The horizontal mattress suture. You take a bite across the wound, you turn the needle around and take a bite back across the wound. You start next to your exit point and you finish next to your starting point. This technique is good for wound eversion. It can also be helpful for eliminating some tension. See our full video on mattress suturing for more detail. The deep dermal. This technique buries the knot once it is tied. You start deep and exit superficial on one side. On the other side, you enter superficial and exit deep. At no stage does your needle or suture material come through the epidermis. You tie your knots parallel to the wound. This is a useful stitch for eliminating tension from a wound. You typically use a long lasting dissolvable suture. The subcuticular suture, an essential technique for linear wounds. You take transverse bites along the wound. These are located within the dermis as superficial as possible without breaching the epidermis. The exit point on one side is the start point on the other side. Here we are demonstrating a pull through subcuticular. For this, you use a monofilament non-dissolvable and remove the suture once the wound is healed. You can also use a dissolvable suture and bury the knot at the start and at the end of the wound.